Okay, so let's go back. This is the part you guys like. Let's look at our rubric. Okay, Miles. Did we see them underline the important information? Yes. yes. So, what did they get? One. So, how many points are you going to give her for that? Okay. Okay. Let's let um, see. Show you another way to solve okay. the problem. Did they draw a picture? All right, so how many points are you going to give her for that? Yes. Accurate yes. picture. Yes. So, what did they get? Butterflies are going to need a home, right? Then, what else might happen at Ola Elementary if we plant this butterfly garden? What else might happen, Emma? Project-based learning for right when we did it is when we had to um, make a paper about what we wanted to do for the yard party. And my opinion was it was really fun because everybody was competing against each other and there's like a hundred and some kids and there's a lot of brains and some of them are really really smart and they can think of a really good idea so everybody wanted to make the air party. Our project based learning driving question was how can we plan a budget on only fifty on only fifty dollars and well something that I liked best was that you had voice and choice and you got to pick what you wanted to do. The, um, the, the project helped me learn how to manage my money better. And so I know like how to run things on a budget and how to do tax and stuff like that. So when I'm older, I can use it. Project-based learning helped me because at the beginning they said, work with everybody in the classroom to try and find out one thing that you would like to do for project-based learning. And it also helped me because there were certain things that you had to do in a certain order, and it helped me way more organized than I usually am. Claire. Um, put, put lots of stuff on the socks and socks on it. Maybe add some soft stuff in it. Good, good idea. I am small. I can unlock doors. All right, Brady, walk me through. What are we going to do here? Hey, puppy. Found then our picture. Found a little puppy. It don't take it out. I'm all right. Oh, you. And sometimes A, mat. B, wrap. C, hat. D, sat. I'm changing the B to M in bat. A, mat. Because of teachers, I can have a good education, get to a good college, and get a nice job, and earn lots of money to make my own family. You now I can learn how to use my my skills to teach other people if they don't know. So thank you. I'm thankful for Paul helping me if I work whenever I need help. I'm thankful for Miss Terrell for helping me learn new things. I'm Terrell because. I could be more smarter and I could have help with things. Thank you, Ms. Johnson, for for helping us type. Now I know how to type. I'm thankful for Ms. Sanders for teaching me fractions and stuff I needed to work.
Sometimes when we be good, we get to go outside like twice. And so you want to thank your teacher for that? All right. Hey, Miss Sanders. I really want to thank you for uh, teaching me math. I really appreciate it, and I think you're the best teacher in the world. Thank you, teachers. Every teacher I know, they always help me, and they always truly always help everybody in the school. I know that because I have teachers all over the place that know me, and I love them for that. And I wish they all have a good luck in the future, and I hope they have all, all of them have awesome times. Thank you, teachers, for um, everything that you do, and that thank you for teaching us math and writing and science and social studies. And it's good to have teachers because if we never had teachers, then we wouldn't be smart, smart enough to learn and to know. I like my teacher and my classmates because um, they're really fun and we don't get bored. So that's why I like about my classroom. Um, I'm thankful for my teachers because they're awesome and they help me um, learn to read. This year because um, we're gonna have a um, beach day. Sorry. So I'm thankful for you for teaching me all I need to learn and helping me do what I have to do. I'm thankful for all my teachers, for all the second grade teachers, for teaching us and for teaching us and making us do so, making us great students and I just like I just thank you for um, helping support second grade for being smart. hope that you have really enjoyed your teacher appreciation week and know that all of your hard work is noticed and truly appreciated. Y'all are wonderful. Thank you. Good afternoon. Luckily, I have been blessed to be with Old Elementary for 10 years now. Uh, and my family has too, which is why I call this the Old Family. It has been a true pleasure uh, working with all of you. Almost all of you have been here almost the entire time that I have. Uh, I can't thank you enough for all that you do. You have to put up with me, which is enough said. Uh, so I really appreciate all the hard work you always do, and I always know that you always have the kids in mind, which makes me always smile. Uh, it makes it easier for me when there are things we need to do or things to talk about to not be angry or mad about them, but to just talk to you about them because I know where your heart is when you make every decision that you make. So thank you for all that you do.